Rob Kardashian reportedly files to lower $20,000 child support payments to his ex, Black China. Ooh, and according to multiple reports, Rob can no longer afford to pay those thousands in child support. And his stance is that he doesn't need to because China is a millionaire. He has a point. She has a lot of money coming in. But apparently, Rob has not been seen on Keeping Up with the Kardashians. That's affecting his income. And of course, since the summer when China and them filed all that restraining order things, things have just been very different for Rob. He has joint custody and they've been fighting for that for Dream. I mean, but China seems to be on the up and up with her lashed brand, her brand deals. Tyga is paying child support for six-year-old King Cairo. Things just seem to be looking a lot better for China than Rob right now. Of course, we're not, you know, really in his finances, so we don't know, but this is all that's been reported. I mean, I think he has a valid point. Mm -hmm. If she's the one making more money, doesn't it kind of make sense that he would have to pay less or at least pay what he can. Right, of course this is all, you know, something that Rob and China are gonna have to work on on their own, but we wanna know should Rob Kardashian's decrease in income reflect a decrease in his child support payments? Let us know and let's keep that conversation going. And on the topic of Rob and being a dad, he's kind of, we've heard turning into a hot dad. Yeah, I mean, one thing about Rob, when he becomes reclusive, he slims down. And I think since Dream has, you know, come in his life, he's made a a really big lifestyle change. He's not one of those dads that has the dad bod and the belly. He's someone who is, you know, making that change for the good. Yeah, in October, a source told ET that the reality star has said has really lost some serious pounds. Right. Um, they were guessing anywhere from 30 to 50. That's a lot. It is a lot. Yeah, they told us, quote, he's got his priorities in check. First and foremost, he is there for Dream, and he knows that to do that, he needs to be healthy. I think with Rob being slimmed down and more private, I mean, it's just better for his overall well-being. We're not seeing as many rants from him. He's spending a lot more time with family. I just always thought Rob was someone who's a family guy. This is the Rob that we know and love. Exactly. We don't love that Rob from July when he was posting those crazy pictures of China. That was crazy. Yeah, it was a lot that they were doing dealing with. But one thing about Rob, like we said, family is first. Chloe and Rob seem to be on better terms now. We know with her evacuating from those California wildfires that she went to Rob's house. So, I mean, things seem to be looking up on that side of things. But of course, things are still really messy with the blowout of China and just this big conversation of child support and where they stand as co-parents. Yeah. Okay, do we think Rob is better staying out of the spotlight or is this hurting him financially? I'm gonna say it may be hurting him a little bit, but I love that he's private. I do too. He should stay out of the spotlight. But we also want to know if you think Rob and China should just go ahead and settle their child support battle. Right, that's something for the court to handle. Yeah. Uh, but of course, Rob seems to be turning his life around. Do we think that the drama is just heating up between him and China? Hopefully it's not, but let's keep the conversation going across social. I'm at Courtney underscore Tezano. And I'm at Hallie underscore Stevens. All right, guys, until next time, we've got you covered for your pop culture fix.